you are welcome how to solve this nice problem in rolling square roots let's work from here and see what is given here is the square root of 4 plus 2 then root 3 now solving this from here we can write this in another way as square root of 4 here we have 3 plus 1 then plus 2 times 1 then times to 3 now we are about to write this in this format when we have a square plus b square plus 2 ab so this can be summarized as a plus b then all square then now we can write here 3 can be written as root 3 square because square we can't do square root and also 1 can be written as 1 square 1 square is still 1 then it implies that here this gives us square root of root 3 square plus 1 square plus 2 times 1 times root 3 and then from this pattern here it implies that we can shorten this as root 3 plus 1 all square and here square we can do square root such that it implies that what we have here which is root 4 plus 2 root 3 now is simply written as root 3 plus 1 then from here we can derive what we have now and put here as simply root 3 plus 1 then the problem given then becomes square root of 9 plus 4 then multiply by that into bracket root 3 plus 1 then from here when we open this bracket root 4 this becomes square root of 9 plus 4 root 3 then plus 4 times 1 here that's 4 then when we have this together here that's 13 then plus 4 that's 13 so we have square root of 13 plus 4 root 3 then from here we can separate this as square root of 1 plus 12 Then plus here we can write this as 2 times 2 that's 4 then times root 3 then also we can write 12 as root 12 square and also 1 as 1 square that is here this cannot be written as square root of 1 square plus root 12 square then plus 2 times here yeah, we have 2 times 1 then times we have 2 times 1 then times here yeah, we can write it as 2 root 3 like this now from here when we have something of the form a square plus b square plus 2ab this same thing as a plus b all square as from earlier stated then here 2 root 3 here and we have 12 here and root 12 here we can equally write root 12 as root 4 times 3 which can be separated as root 4 times root 3 and root 4 is 2 which is 2 then times root 3 so now from 
here what we have then becomes square root of 1 square plus here is now 2 root 3 all square then plus 2 times 1 times 2 root 3 now this follows from here a square plus b square plus 2 is equals to a plus b all square here where a is 1 and b is 2 root 3 then this now equals to square root of into bracket 1 plus 2 root 3 square then here square cancel square roots then what we have is just 1 plus 2 root 3 and here we have the answer to be given problem as 1 plus 2 root 3 so from here what is given now is now equal to 1 plus 2 root 3 thank you for joining us subscribe to this channel and turn on the notification bell share this video if you have another way of solving this put it in the comment section and see you next class bye for now